a long, long time ago. Actually, roughly about 60 years ago, in a land full of confused humans, plastic became mainstream. This plastic thing was made out of very easily accessible product, aka fossil fuels, aka liquefied freaking dinosaurs and plants that died millions of years ago, which was drilled out of the depths of the earth. Makes sense. Clever humans. Today, plastic lives amongst us in peace and harmony. Not really. It's a huge problem, but you already know that. Here is a turtle with a straw stuck up its nose. Here is a diver amongst beautiful jellyfish. Oh, <laughs> I mean plastic. Here is a beautiful bird chirping. Oh, <laughs> I mean dead because it ate plastic. Here is fish that you eat that is probably filled with microplastics. Mmm. Here is water that keeps you alive and is filled with microplastics. Mmm. And here is a human that is dying because he's poisoned with plastic. It's actually stock footage of someone in hospital, but it's actually happening to all of us. All of us are getting poisoned. That includes your mom, your dad, your auntie, your uncle, your sister sister, your bro, your nieces, your friends, everybody's getting poisoned. Okay, so now that the sarcastic tone is out of the way because, hi, I'm Australian and that's the way we communicate, <laughs> let me show you how you can take one room at a time from your house and make it plastic free to help us all live. <laughs> Live, that's it, <laughs> just live. Plastic free, yeah. bathroom time, yeah. plastic free, yeah. bathroom time. Shampoo in a bottle? Nope. There are stores such as Lush or theplasticfreeshop.com where you can get bars of shampoo. It's genius and it actually works much better than any shampoo I've ever tried in my life and I've tried a lot before I became plastic free. They have lots of different available options in the plastic free shampoo bars section so you can find one that will suit your hair type. Same with conditioner. Same with soap. And all of these live in these cute little steel containers that you can reuse again and again. Alternatively, you can also use different products if these are too hard for you to get a hold of or if they are too expensive. You can try things as such as baking soda mixed with water for shampoo and then apple cider vinegar for your conditioner, which works a treat. Here is a toothbrush made out of bamboo. It decomposes really fast after you've used it. Unlike the plastic toothbrushes, which stick around for about 500 years and will probably end up in an animal's animal. Oh god, that's so painful. Here is toothpaste in an aluminium tin. I personally use these toothpaste tabs from Lush, which come in a plastic, fully recyclable container. However, <laughs> recycling doesn't actually work, it's just a business, so I'm not very happy that I'm using these, but I'm still yet to find toothpaste that actually works, that is natural and in a little tub. But I'm searching, as soon as I find it, I will update you, but please keep searching. Don't just rely on my answers. You find something that works for you. There is lots of lots of lots of different options out there a natural toothpaste though that you can also make at home is this wham bam sham damn <laughs> google the recipe many easy to make here's tooth floss that is made out of silk and natural wax here is a menstrual cup that is basically a gift from the god yes this lives in my vagina when i have my period i completely forget that it's there it collects all of my blood it doesn't leak at all it is amazing it saves you money and it saves the environment if you're still not using these holy crap you're missing out on one of the greatest inventions that have ever existed, really. Unless you're a guy, then you don't really need it, so that's cool. <laughs> Here is my steel razor, which I freaking adore with these little individual steel razor blades. They are sharp as heck. You need a few goes at the beginning to get it slowly all over your legs and not cut yourself. Unfortunately, it happens a little bit, um, but just practice. Just like you're riding a bicycle, you gotta learn some stuff and you're doing good for the planet, so it's fine. Take your time when you're switching over to these razor blades. Here's my makeup remover, my face moisturizer, and my body moisturizer. Good for the inside, good for the outside. Here is my face wash. Here are cotton buds that I use, which I found wrapped up in paper. Alternatively, I've heard of this new product called the Face Halo, which I am yet to try, but apparently it changes the game. Here is my deodorant. It comes in a block. It works pretty damn good, and there's lots of different options. Again, if you Google it, packagefreeshop.com also has these. I will say that it's probably not quite as good as the deodorants that have aluminium in them, and they block your pores. Frankly, <laughs> if there's any product that's going to be blocking the natural discharge, from the largest organ in my body, which is my skin, then I don't want that anyway. I'd prefer to smell a little bit <laughs> than be blocking my damn pores. No. Here is my lip balm, which comes in a little aluminium tin. There are plastic-free hair ties available online. Here is the best damn skin exfoliator that has ever lived as well. Freaking hell. It lasts you for such a long time. It's called the Beta Mitten and it's made out of bamboo and it is gonna give you the best skin. This is my skin before I had the Beta Mitten and this is what I have now. I've used it for eight years and it works a freaking treat. It has stabilized my skin. I use it all over my body, face, down to my booty <laughs> and beyond. <laughs> Here is a serum that I use from Lush. It is highly moisturizing and it is also package free. Wooden or steel hairbrushes or combs are a thing and they look pretty damn cool. Toilet brush cleaners made from wood, 
also a thing. Here is toilet paper from Who Gives a Crap, one of my favorite brands. They don't even use trees to make toilet paper. They use recycled paper and it's soft and it's great. My bum is very, very happy. And they also make paper towels. And obviously some other standard utensils, which I think you already have plastic free. Oh, and these are plastic free cotton buds if you use cotton buds. Yep, I did rush through all of these options, but I just wanted you guys to see that there are basically substitutes for pretty much every single product that you use already. If you still are missing some things that need to be replaced with your plastic products, comment down below. I'll try to help you out and people in the community, if you guys can help out, if you have answers, make sure you read and assist people back down below. We're trying to help the world here, so it takes some time to answer their questions, concern, queries, because I can't do it all by myself, basically. And if you know any other great plastic-free alternatives, please list them down below. To make this easy to transition into a plastic-free lifestyle, I am gonna be putting up all the information about plastic free, what I've found through makeup, toiletries, everyday products, anything else that I can, I'm gonna be putting it up on my website on a plastic free tab that I'm gonna put up there on my beautiful Squarespace website. <laughs> Perfect transition. Thank you Squarespace for sponsoring this video. If you would like to display any of your work that you are working on beautifully, and if you don't have coding experience, Squarespace is the best website for all your needs to make it super easy. I personally use this, I've been using it before I was sponsored, they were my first sponsor and I'm so happy that we're still working together. I freaking love this product. Whether you need a domain website or online store, do it with Squarespace. Not only do they have beautiful designer templates, they are also an all-in-one platform. There's nothing to install, upgrade, or patch ever. Alongside award-winning 24-7 customer service, it has never been easier to create your online empire. Check out squarespace.com for a free trial, and when you are ready to launch, go to squarespace.com forward slash Sorel to save 10% off your first purchase of a domain or website. Pretty please with a cherry on top, spread this video far and wide. The more people that understand how easy it is, that means that we get to have a happy future for ourselves and for our children. Here's my Instagram and Twitter if you would like to see more. And until next time, guys.